Hey everyone, Starthus here. In this video, I wanted to go over modifying your expansion market currency. If you haven't already, check out the video in the corner where I explain the various trader files. In this video, I'll be using Visual Studio Code to find and replace data in multiple files. Check out this other video to learn how to do that. Let's get started. There are six currencies that come with Expansion Market. For our first example, I'm going to replace the gold and silver nuggets and bars with US dollars. So let's open the Market Settings JSON file. And replace these lines with the currency we want. Then do the same lines in all the trader.json files. Once that's done, you're all set using a single currency. Let me reset my files, and then we can set it up for multiple currencies and go over using a currency exchange. For this next example, I'm going to be adding the US dollar, but removing the gold and silver nuggets. So we'll go to the market settings JSON file, remove what we don't want, and add the US dollar. Then do the same for all the trader.json files. And now traders will accept all three of these currencies. One thing to consider when using multiple currencies like this is that you may want to set up a currency exchange. One way to do this is with a dedicated exchange trader. Expansion already has this set up out of the box. It uses the exchange trader file along with the exchange market file. As well as a trader map file to allow players to exchange one currency for another. And if we look at the green mountain trader map file, it has an exchange machine using the exchange trader file. If you wanted to, you could just switch out the exchange machine for one of the trader NPC names. Just make sure you change the location for this trader, since I believe this is inside of a wall. Another way to implement currency exchange is to add the exchange category to all your trader.json files. This would allow players to exchange gold and silver bars for currency at any trader they interact with. Let's demonstrate the second method for setting up currency exchange. Our market setting file already has the currencies from earlier. Now we need to add the US dollar to the exchange market file. And then remove the nuggets. and then edit the values. Since banknotes stack up to 10,000, I'll make one silver bar worth a stack of notes. So, 10,000. This makes a stack of 100 silver bars worth $1 million. And then for the gold bars, we'll make them worth 20,000. 
giving us $2 million for a stack of 100 gold bars. Then we can go to each of our trader JSON files and add the exchange category to them. That's pretty much it. I hope you found this updated video helpful. I'll be keeping both videos up since the older video does mention adding a money mod. But if you like this video, hit that like button and maybe consider subscribing. I will be releasing more content in the future, so stick around. Thanks.